पुष्कर गाय थे माधवन विजय सेतुपति वी ऑल नो एंड दोस्ट हू डोंट वेल नो ग्रेट टैमल हिट विक्रम वेदा they revisited from the precincts of bollywood and thank you bollywood for coming back to life brahmastra first and now vikram veda showing signs of uh, getting footfalls back in the studio at the theaters vikram veda has every reason why a guy who likes cinema should be watching To those who believe that commercial cinema is larger than life, meaningless, go and see Vikram Veda. For those of us, oh, millions of us who love all the action, the drama, the thrills, the fights, go and watch Vikram Veda. Tom and Jerry, good and evil, is not new. start off with ganga jamuna go on you can come right down ram lakhan deewar what have you the inspector the undercover the inspector versus the criminal it's been happening for years what however makes vikram veda a different fellow is it does not sympathize but the criminal it does not make a hero out of the police officer it takes two stances as this let's examine these stances and so you have vikram a police officer who is proud of 18 encounters you have veda a gang lord who is accused of 15 murders the conflict is therefore not between good and evil it's about the need to reexamine the shades of gray compulsive intuitive decision how often in life do we sit to decide what is right what is wrong from a rational logistic part How often are these decisions a product of a drift? Every time Vikram, the successful police officer in search of Veda, is on the prowl and finally gets to him, Veda throws up a scenario, a situation connected to the crime, connected to the offence. and asks who is responsible and the variations it could be the puppeteer and the puppet and criminal who saves a man's life and a police officer who kills where is your gratitude who do you say what do you do is what thematically pushkar gayatri are dealing with they take the old wine but this time the bottle is so very good that you just glide your wine in in terms of performances this radhika apte in a small role as vikram's wife and a lawyer in her own capacity who continues to disapprove of vikram's story and also at some stage the relationship reaches a level when each one of them is professionally using the other the conflict in the marriage she handles it with great maturity but finally as the film is it's all about vikram and veda for a good 20 minutes of the film you only have vikram the beefy polished saif ali khan doing arguably one of his best in recent times is well beefed up for the role he's not over the top like some actors do when they are given the role of a police officer and in the script ensures that he's not 
a trigger happy police officer, notwithstanding the fact that he is an encounter specialist. There are those typical systemic justifications of the policemen taking over and believing that what they're doing is right. Don't you investigate and then judge? How do you first judge and then investigate? Is a question thrown out in the film. Coincidences don't happen. They are all by design, is another statement. Hold back, sit down, and think of these lines. And what's Ruthie Roshan's film without a dance? So, necessarily don't miss out the Alcoholia song, Ruthie in his element. That's just a fraction of this actor. Moving from his love for his foster relatives, to the passion, to the anger, to, the, to every emotion that you would expect from an actor in a film. You have this and more in a near brilliant performance from Ruthie Krosh. Obviously, with two actors, like Ruthie and Seth, the question is going to be, who's better, Seth or Ruthie? Ruthie or Seth? The greatness of this film is that Seth and Ruthie are not competing with each other. They are supplementing one another. So perfectly that you bow down to the script you recognize the Pushkar Gayatri believe that the script is more important than the star. But somewhere, just somewhere, probably because we all have a sympathy for the underdog, or probably because he's a superior actor and he's a star, it is Rithik Roshan who gets all the whistles and the cat calls in the movie. Independent of what kind of cinema you like, Independent of who of these actors you are a fan of. And if you're not of either, Radhika up there. Even if not she. For the sheer factor that commercial cinema can give you something authentic. Go for Vikram Veda. My acknowledgements to Abhinav and Radhika and Datu for helping out the entire scenario of the shoot and the process of taking it all to all of you. Thank you very much. Do watch Vikram Veda.